XQC got signed for 100 million, Sapnap got signed, and also many other big creators got signed. But what is behind the platform, Kick? Kick, owned by Stake, is a streaming platform that allows gambling and corn, for example. One of the biggest streamer of the platform, Aiden Ross, got banned on Twitch prior to the signing on Kick. He now is co-owner. On the first stream, he got a fraction of the viewers and began watching corn on stream. He is a friends with Andrew Tate. But why is Kick so open to this content of gambling and other stuff? Well, maybe because it is owned by gambling website. After the ban of gambling on Twitch Stake decided to make their own platform with their own regulations. Many streamers are being bought for huge amounts of money like XQC. After all of this, Sapnap got signed on Kick. This might be problematic because most of his audience are minors and often part of the LGBTQIA community. Hate waves and homophobia, transphobia and misogyny are normal on Kick. This might not be the best option for Sapnap. Also, he said that he does not want to support Amazon. Even though it is hosted on AWS, AWS is Amazon Web Services, owned by Amazon. The streamer Tubbo said that he has responsibility for their community. This is the clip. Sapnap, I'm just gonna say like, frankly, the majority of Sapnap's demographic is people in communities such as LGBTQIA+, um, younger demographic and stuff like that. I feel like this platform is not a safe place to be openly trans, not a safe place to be openly Jewish, not a safe place to be black, for example. It's insane. And I just, I don't like, I feel like it's great that you want to spearhead that positive change, but also with such a large and powerful voice you have and so much good you can do with that voice. It's it's best that you're more responsible with where you want to bring your community and you have a responsibility to protect them as well. 